close. You can't ask for a better debut. NWA on fire has just seen the future of tag team wrestling. Folks, the Logan brothers, unbelievable victory here tonight. Matt, Brian, the Logans in the NWA, and let me tell you, they made a promise they were going right to the top, and I don't think you can get any higher than they are right now. Look at how the people have taken to the Logan brothers here in the NWA on fire with the TV cameras rolling. I cannot, let me let them talk. Champions all over the East Coast, folks. As you can see, the Logans made a challenge and the Players Club came right out, folks. Davey Boy Bling and Danny DeMonto have, have hit the ringside area. Not one to back down from a fight. Well, we learned the Players Club can count to five, but Oh, look at that, teasing the crowd that they were going to get into it with the Logans and give the crowd what they wanted. Bling and DeMonto, they're saying right now is not the right time, folks. Folks, this is a match that could sell out buildings anywhere in the United States. And let me tell you something, it will. We'll be right back with NWA on Fire. NWA on Fire returns Sunday, December 28th to the Nassau Community Center. Special bell time, 6 p.m. A triple main event. The Logan Brothers and Juicy Justin go up against the new Players Club. A mixed tag team match. A lady and a midget. Coco Beware versus Cactus. All the NWA on Fire stars. Get your stocking stuffers now. Sorry, sir, your credit card's been declined. Are you one of the millions of Americans with $2,000 or more in credit card debt? Would you like to cut your monthly payments by as much as half? Credit Guard of America can help. At Credit Guard of America, they analyze your total unsecured debt and give you the best solution that fits your needs. Credit Guard's money management solutions even include credit counseling. Credit Guard helped with my home equity loan. They helped with my IRS problems. And my debt settlement. Credit Guard even gave me free counseling to help with my student loan. Whether you're current and making minimum payments, behind or about to fall behind, learn how you can achieve financial freedom with Credit Guard's free money management counseling service. We did it! Pick up the phone and call right now to speak to one of Credit Guard's certified credit counselors. If you're in debt $2,000 or more, Credit Guard can help you solve your financial worries. Call 800-810-5451. NWA on Fire returns Sunday, December 28th to the Nassau Community Center. Special bell time, 6 p.m., a triple main event. The Logan Brothers and Juicy Justin go up against the new Players Club. A mixed tag team match. A lady and a midget. Coco Beware versus Cactus. All the NWA on Fire stars. Get your stocking stuffers now. Folks, I'm Ricky O, joined by Mr. Main Event. And let me tell you right now, NWA on Fire is back. And here we go with some action with the Blue Knight taking on Cousin Larry. And I'll tell you what, we're looking forward to one heck of a matchup here. This Blue Knight has really bust onto the scene here in NWA, right here on Fire. And I'll tell you what, Cousin Larry just speaks for himself. One half 
of the scuffling hillbillies, and that's one big man in there, you know? Absolutely. If you notice, Cousin Larry's got a little bit of a meaner disposition the last couple weeks here at NWA on fire. I think he's taken a little more serious to losing streak with the hillbillies. He's finally gotten to it. Well, you saw him go after his own, uh, his own kin, as the word they would use, Uncle Sonny. And... Uh, I, I don't really know what the what the problem is there. I, I, maybe he just wants to win a little more than, well, I want to say he wants to win more than Sonny does. All these guys are pure athletes, and they want sometimes, to win. Yeah, well, sometimes as an athlete, losing is frustrating, and I think it's frustrating. Yeah. I will not talk any bad on one of the greatest tag teams anywhere in the United States, man, anywhere in the world. Singles competition we've seen a lot out of lately now from the Scufflin Hillbillies. Maybe a dissension amongst the ranks, you know, you never know. You never know. But either one of those guys will make excellent singles competitors. Absolutely. And they got the Blue Knight right there, a little bit of a size disadvantage. But uh, a very solid technical wrestler, uh, FBI, CIA, CTU trained. This guy is a deadly force in the ring. Oh, yes, he is. You know, those Black Ops guys, man, they're nothing to mess with, man. I'm telling you. I know. I mean, uh, I watch Jack Bauer, and uh, he's pretty tough. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. Clean break right there by the Blue Knight. So these guys go through some intense physical training. So a wrestling ring is basically maybe a backyard playground of the Blue Knight. Absolutely. I mean, these guys are used to fighting terrorists and, uh, you know, diffusing bombs. I think wrestling uh, just breaks down to being a matter of being a science for him. Oh, Larry oh. backs him into the corner with a huge overhand chop. I think everyone back at the CTU heard that one. That was loud. L-O-U-D loud. Oh, he's taking him from one corner to another, just throwing vicious chops at him. Oh. oh he finally ducked under that third one. That was Big that, right hands. That was that way with all there. Right there the Coming right back. Shoots him in. Oh, big shoulder to the midsection. And that hunched Larry Larry over. Cousin Larry appears to have the wind knocked out of him. And at the mercy of the Blue Knight at this point, reining him in two, three. It's a math lesson here for Rockland, Maine. Oh. Huge atomic drop. And a running, running forearm clothesline by Cousin Larry. One, two, no. Two count only is uh, pointed out by the referee there. The scoop, the slam by Cousin Larry. Using the front ropes. Oh, big elbow drop. And he got every bit of that. Two, no. Why am I acting surprised? I mean, the Blue Knight does have some wherewithal. We've already seen that. The kid can take a beating. He's trained by some of the best in the world. Coming from the middle rope. Oh, missile drop kick hits its mark. Right in the sternum of Cousin Larry. He might have knocked Larry unconscious with that drop kick. Could be. You see the way that head went back and slapped that mat? That's nothing to mess with, brother. Oh, there's some payback for those chops earlier in the night. A little wobbly. Big tree going to fall here in Rockland? No. Oh. oh able to use, use that incoming momentum by the Blue Knight and sling him off into the ropes and right in to, to the, the DVD. That's One. a slop drop. Folks, right there you got Cousin Larry outsmarting him for the 1-2-3. Folks, Larry, as you can see right there with the victory, but let me tell you, does this guy got a face a mother could love? Oh my God. He's demanding a microphone right now. Oh wait, no, it, he wants to dance. Folks, we'll be right back. I don't even think Larry knows what he wants. Here I am, ladies and gentlemen. Here I am at the Powerhouse Gym. I told you I'd find him, and I did find him. The Flying Logan Brothers out of Boston, Massachusetts, looking to get into the NWA, looking to face the tough competition at the NWA. Guys, I just want to ask you a couple of questions. 